teams for the USA and Serbia met with Paolo Turchi from Brazil to do the coin toss. Romania Petric leading Serbia out to this packed stadium here in Turin. Just like the USA, Serbia have had to pick themselves up from their semi-final defeat and get ready for this encounter. One last chance to get on the podium and to get a bronze medal. USA led out by Taylor Sander. May well be feeling it just a little bit more than Serbia. As they were beaten by Poland in an epic five set thriller. Serbia were beat convincingly by Brazil 3 0. Uh, and just a little bit more rest. Didn't play as much volleyball. This is what we've got coming. Serbia versus the USA is our feature game. And then after that, Brazil will be taking on Poland in a repeat of the 2014 World Championship final that took place in Poland. Teams are out on court, flag bearers in position. It's time for the national anthems of both countries. We'll start with Serbia and then we'll finish with the USA. <laughs> The national anthem of the United States of America. Ed ora l'inno nazionale degli Stati Uniti d'America. Referee's in charge of this one formally. And the first referee on the left of your screen, Paolo Turchi of Brazil. 
very experienced referee. And he'll be ably assisted by Nasir Shaban of Egypt. Before we see the stars on the court, we'll get a glimpse of what the stars might look like in the sky if they were made of smartphones. It's a pretty cool view. It actually lights up the court here. Time for Serbia then to make their way onto court. And it's going to be the captain, Nemanja Petric, number four, starting through the outside. Number eight, Marko Ivovic, through the outside. Number nine, Nikola Jovovic, will be setting. Number 14, in the opposite slot, Alexander Antanasievic. Marko Podraskanin, number 18, going through the middle. And number 20, Shretsko Lisinac, also going through the middle. Nikola Rosic gets the start as the uh, libero, but also we will see Nevan Mesterovic. That's how they line up. Ivovic is at one, Petric is at four. Time then for the USA to come out onto court. There's no change from the team that played in the semi-final. Number one, Matthew Anderson in the opposite slot. Number two, Aaron Russell through the outside. Number three, the captain, Taylor Sander, through the outside. Number 10, Daniel McDonald, middle blocking. Number 11, Mika Christensen is setting. And number 12, Maxwell Holt is going through the middle. Starting Libero, Eric Shoji, number 22. This is how the USA are lining up. Sander is at four, Russell. Sander's at one and Russell is at four. One last chance for a medal. These two teams met 18 days ago in Bari in round one in their first match of the World Championship. It was a 3-2 victory for the USA on that day. How will this one go? And more importantly, who will get a bronze medal? The USA in red serving, Serbia in blue receiving. It is the bronze medal match of the FIVB Men's Volleyball World Championship here in Turin, Italy. A magnificent event that's been co-hosted in Bulgaria as well for the first time ever, two countries hosting a world championship. It has been a roaring success. And for one of these teams, it will end as a roaring success. Lizinats, good serve by him. That has Christensen trying to find Anderson, and he does that perfectly well. Gets it off the block and away. Tester for Christensen, Sander and Russell not with the best of passes, but really good finish by Anderson. Good swing through the middle for Podraskinin.
Oh, that's a big block. USA getting three blockers out, and there was nowhere for Atanasievich to go. Serbia will take that one. Good swing by Holt. Both teams are able to get their side out at the moment. It's a little bit scrappy, both sides. No one getting full control of what's going on just yet. with the serve. with a good swing. No one taking away the cross-court angle. And that one's gone down in front of Serbia. That won't come back. A nice pick up and into transition. Tanasiewicz gets it in the, between the blockers. Tactics being adopted by John Sparrow as Smith puts that one down. Smith didn't start this game, but Donald started the game. But what John Sparrow's been doing of late has been uh, letting McDonald play a rotation, then bringing Smith in to play a rotation, and then McDonald back in. So it effectively giving the middle blockers of the other team three different middle blockers to have to play against. It's a 
double. It's come late, but it is a double. Serbia then head into the technical timeout. They lead by two. Lizanets likes to hit that spot. The other side of the line, he likes to hit that spot. Petric with a clever shot. Smith wasn't ready for it. with the serve. Easy leave, that one for Petric. See the players are just perhaps not as quick and as sharp as they have been, which is what you might expect 18 days after this tournament started. But given the supreme athleticism of these players, the level is still very high. Serbia currently with a one point advantage. Chance for the USA to level it up. It's a good pick up by Anderson, and it's Sander who gets the block out. by Podrashkinin. Good block by Ivovic and Lizinac.
Podreskin in with the serve. Podreskin in, could do nothing about this. Quick ball behind. Ivovic can't get out there. There's enough space for Anderson to work that ball to the line. Net touch against the USA. Sandu does a great job. Well, both of these teams have players with previous World Championship experience. They also have players with previous World Championship medals. The USA have two bronze medalists in their ranks, Matthew Anderson and Maxwell Holt. And that was achieved back in 1994 when they beat Cuba 3-1 event being held in Greece. This one's bobbling around a bit. Bit of space for Atanasievic, and he's just found the ball comes straight back into him off of an excellent block from the USA. Really well done. USA getting out there and closing down the space. Nice work by Antanasievich. Go-to player at the moment, Antana Sievich. Serbia's two players who have World Championship bronze medal. Podrashkinin, who's at the net. And Nikola Grivic, who's coaching. That was from back in 2010. Squeaks through. Tanisievich. Very good swing off the block that showed you can't chase down. Serbia keeping hold of their two point lead at the moment. set and a really really good hit Christensen off and running Anderson taking on the block getting over the top of it
Mizanats with the serve. Ooh. It's an illegal attack by Sand. It wasn't the fact that he played it with the, the way he did. He couldn't get it with his right hand, tried to get it with his left. But when he did so, he'd uh, taken off on the three metre line. And Serbia take another point, and as such, USA call a timeout. Was it a grind here? Yeah, it was a grind. It was a grind. Oh, yeah, it was push. It was push. All right, it's past another ball against Sayaka. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, we're good. USA. Let's go. Come on, guys. Swing by Smith. Big swing from Smith off the serve. Chivovic hoists high. Tanasiewicz again brutalizing the block with that swing, getting the ball out of play. It's a good serve. Serbia do very well to get something on that block. Nice pick up by Sander. Well, it was straight back at Anderson and he couldn't self recover. Serbia take the point. Distance it probably would have had it as well. But instinct makes you want to play that one. Good dig by Mastorovic. Net touch by Serbia. USA take that point. That's a huge block from Holtz. Excellent job by Max Holt. Touch. Good pick up by Rosic. 
Nice work by Ivovic to keep that one alive, but there's no way he's touching it next time round. Holt buries it into the floor. And the USA have levelled this set. Timeout called by Serbia. in play by Anderson. But not after Antanasiewicz had the swing. And just like that, after allowing the USA to get back level at 19 all, the USA then gives Serbia two points. And now they call a timeout. Draskin in then with the serve. Yes, they have to dig deep again. Russell in charge of that in recycling, and it's Anderson who finds a gap in the block. from Russell because he held Lizinac long enough to make things tricky for Serbia as it went out to Anderson. Swing by Smith, right off the head of, of, uh, of Tanasiewicz, who gives himself a good talking to. Christensen to miss those types of serves. Oh, very nice. That's all Sander was interested in. 
Capwell's block out. Done it brilliantly. No carry called. Serbia with a chance to bring up set point, and it's the captain who does it. Petric gets it off the block and out. And that's missed that one by uh, a country mile. He was trying to get the ball down to position five deep. Serbia call their second timeout. They make David Smith wait before he gets to serve. Set point, and it's been taken by Serbia. And they take the first set, 25-23, in this bronze medal match. Big swing, Antanasievic. Above the, as you can see, it's not above the height of the antenna generally, which goes to show when you see players spike heights and their spike reaches, and I'll just give you a read a few of them out here for you. As you have a look at the stats, it tells you we only had five blocks, no aces, and USA made ten errors. Spike heights for Serbia. Okolic, 
3 meters 47, Kovatrevic 340, Katic 345, Petric who's on court 333, Chris Manovic who's not on court 354, Marko Ivovic who is 1 meter 94 reputedly spikes at 3 meters and 65. Well he doesn't. What he can do though is he can jump up in the air and reach as high as he possibly can with one hand and touch a mark on a wall or a point that's hanging down from some contraption to say he touched 3 meters 65. And as we saw from the previous step, real-time spiking is around about 325, 330 exceptional circumstances between 335 and 340 would be exceptional spike heights that we have seen and 340 about the highest so for the likes of Uros Kovacevic who reportedly touches 340 he's probably spiking around 325 330 <laughs> set two underway Ivovic it is We'll have the serve. That's a great ball in by Shoji. Off was a tough serve by Ivovic. Oh, carry call against Serbia. They're not happy about it. Well, if he's just going to explain that when you're playing the ball into the block, if it stays in your hand and see you just see that that's a pedantic outburst from Natanasiewicz saying no I didn't I just I just barely touched it but he didn't he took it and he pushed it into the block and that's a carry Sander with the serve Lizinets he is a player who can hit very high and hits around the top of the antenna at times that one's not caught the block Lizinac, though, reportedly only touches 3 metres 55, 10 centimetres lower than Marko Ivovic. And Lizinac is 2 metres and 5 tall. It's that old saying, lies, damn lies, and statistics. Taylor Avril for the USA report reportedly touches 3 metres 70. Ben Patch, 368. That is really difficult to tell what's happened, but no touch has been given. It's just to put things in perspective, the net height, 2 metres and 43, which would mean the players are hitting the ball nearly 2 metres above it in some instances. That would be quite frightening, wouldn't it? Any player who could hit one meter 30 above the height of the net would never, in theory, get blocked because all they'd need is a high ball. They could go over every block that currently exists, even Muzerski's, and put the ball on the floor. It's a good lead by the USA. Quick not to get caught. Petric. <laughs> Lovely swing from Holt has taken that one into the corner. Holt 
started the team in 2010. They got a sixth, along with Matt Anderson. At the World Championships was then in Greece. Dig by Petric. Great swing by Sander. The Nats did well, made sure the ball went down and also made sure he didn't touch the net. Not a great serve by Jovovic. When these two teams met in Bari in the first round of this World Championship, Serbia winning it 3-2. Serbia took the first set 25-15, and the USA took the next set 25-14. It was a really strange start to the match, where both teams suddenly went from being very good to being very bad, alternately. And then it got a lot closer. Serbia took the third, 25-21. USA, the fourth, 25-20. And then they took the decider, 15-10, in two and a quarter hours. That's a great block. Smith up, committing on Lizinac. That is a monster block, David Smith. Say lead by three at the technical time out. We've had a couple opportunities. Let it go. Let's get go. to the next one. Let's go. Let it get to the next one. I'm gonna shoot the one that oh. the most rotating overhead. So whoever's blocking out there, make sure you're ready on the dying ball. Hey, or shoot the like big shots though, so make sure we're good with that left hand and get over that net. Okay? All right. Here we go. Another dodgy set, which got a few oohs around the arena. USA got away with it. However, Serbia doing well, playing to the whistle and then taking the point. Rizmanovic putting that one on the floor.
Good work. USA haven't run much of that pipe. That time they did, Chris Manovic went with Smith and there was a space for Russell to go into. We've got a problem here. Taylor Sanders got an injury to his shoulder and I think that's the end of his tournament. It's going to be a substitution, he's going to get it looked at, but it doesn't look good. He was talking with the coach as he went to serve. If your hitting arm's not working, that's it. Your staff's just going to do some work with the physio. We're going to have a look at that. Hopefully he's all right and he'll come back. But right now, he's out, Langlois is in. USA increasing their lead now in this set. That's an error from Serbia. And they call timeout. USA from six they got two and then after at nine they got another one. Too many unforced errors at the moment from Serbia. It's quite comfortable for the USA now. Although Serbia have decided to challenge this decision as to whether or not it caught the block on its way out. Touched by Smith. Langloy not really sure about that one. Oh, but he's kept it in play though. And so too is Smith. Free ball for Serbia. Nice blocking from Anderson as he gets the better of Serbia's captain. Great block. In. Great 
swing by Podraskin. Good set. That's a wonderful piece of volleyball. Shoji working his socks off to get that ball into Christensen, who fires it out on a straight line. one thing after another a poor pass a terrible set and an awful hit with the greatest respect there is no need for Ivovic to try and send that ball all the way over that side of the court when he's got a hitter right next to him who can have a swing against two blockers double substitution by Serbia Lubrich is in, and so too is uh, Ivan Kostic. That's a good lead. touch a few oozes that one was put over but it was the setter who doubled it and got away with it and would you believe it Serbia touched the net campaign matters USA get the point into the second technical timeout big lead for the USA It's a nice pass by Ivovic and a positive set which is kept in the air by the USA more by luck than judgment and in the end Serbia get the ball and Kostic was having a little bit of a ding-dong through the net then screaming and shouting put away by Ivovic See Kostic just shouting through the net. If we saw that, he'd be in trouble. It looks very much like this match is going to become one set of piece. Good serve from Holt. Petric couldn't deal with that one.
Ibrahimovic again, not a fast arm, whipping through the ball. It's a good player, Ibrahimovic, good skills player. Christensen again likes to go on that E quick and shoot ball out wide. It's on a straight line, this ball. Look at that. Straight line. Slightest, slightest of arcs on it. Not much. Langlois. Thank you very much. Good swing. Overpass, not dealt with. Anderson does well, that's off of the block. So quick, Lubrich just thought it gone out. Didn't see the contact. That noise is having a, a mixed bag of a set at the moment. He's in because Taylor Sanders injured his hitting arm. Good up by Christensen. Good up by Vovic. Some good recycling by Serbia. And a big, heavy hit from Lubric. To give Serbia the point. Good blocking. The USA really don't want to let Serbia get a run of points now and get some momentum and make this set tricky. They've done very well to build up a big lead. And that is a super block by Cover Trevor. He's only just come on to court. Excellent. It's great watching good middle hitters who get up and put everything through the swing. Give themselves the space to do it as well. Big full arm swing, and Smith able to get right through that. Contact all the way through, arm extension, without hitting the net. See far too many middle blockers get in too close and then get jammed up on the ball. Trevic with the error, and now USA much more settled and much closer to taking the set. It's outside the antenna. Another good serve from Smith, but it's in a good position for Kostic, although it should have been a double touch against him. Play continues, it's subjective, mind. Double touches and carries. It's up to the referee, not the players, to call it. You play to the whistle, which is what the USA have done. And they've got the point.
Chance for set point. Good out by Kostic. There's a net fault against Podaskin. It wasn't the double touch he made. Sander having come back into the action. Ranloy back to the bench. Hatch yet to get on. USA have set point. Work by Kovatrevich. Russell wasn't watching, hadn't closed the net properly. And Russell's now made an error. USA dragging this out. Serbia give USA the set point they need. They take it 25-17. It's now one all here in this bronze medal match. This is where the USA have been setting the ball. That green zone's ideal, although potentially not all the way over to the antenna bottom of the court. Uh, it does limit your options behind you. You want it around about where the bottom of the uh, seven is for 79%. In between there is about perfect. USA got themselves an ace, couple of blocks. Both teams made nine errors each. But Serbia's attacking. Didn't even make double figures. Third set, underway, Smith will serve. Well, what was going on there? Referee had 
But he'd blown for service, like he'd blown for service, but then no one seemed to be ready. That was all a little bit muddled. Lucinets for Serbia. Oh, we're back as we were. Lucinets showing some good sporting spirit by also putting his serve into the net. Well, just for a moment, we seem to have stumbled onto the world missing the serve championships. But don't worry, normal service will be resumed imminently. That is a very good serve. But an equally good side out by Serbia. With Podreskin finding a gap through the middle. Russell had to make an adjustment for that, couldn't swing hard on the ball. Matanasevich does brilliant pick up by Christensen. And an excellent block, Podrashkin in. Serbia open up a two point lead. Fort rally for the USA. Sanders hitting arm seems to be okay again. And his blocking arms are working perfectly. Great scramble, but it won't stay in play. Jovovic did his absolute best off of that really difficult serve that Rossic struggled to deal with. Delay. A lot of perspiration to be cleared off the court for that dive by Ivovic.
Lizinac was nowhere near Smith. Lots of movement for the USA, making it difficult for the block to know who was going to get the ball. That's great blocking again from the USA. Smith this time. Good up by Shoji. Clever play from Anderson into the technical timeout. USA lead 8 5. Cover by Russell, and he ran, well, did run into Christensen. And Anderson whips that past the block, past Luberic. USA now with a four-point advantage. Good re really good play by Russell. He runs out of the way of the traffic so that there's a hitting lane for Anderson to go into. The ball went into the net, it didn't catch the block. The USA aren't going to challenge it. Four touches has been given against them. There's nowhere near, isn't it? Good work by Smith. Smart hitting from him. And a great block. Luberitz. Oh, what a good swing. Good covering by Vovic. Really good effort by Luberitz. A serve from Ivovic. Yes. 
Alexander and Shoji just stepped away from each other. Good covering. Very nice hit by Petric. He's coming in again. Kovacevic has had a bit of a rest now. Lubric is in and is a direct replacement for Atanasievic. And this run of points now means USA call timeout. Oh, that's a tremendous pickup, and that's an even better one. Serbia scrambling to get back into position, and that's a great hit down the line by Russell. A rally to really get the crowd going here. Really good pickup. Mustarovic just gets it back. Russell. Really good swing to that line. Jovovic is quite a player, a player that you can tell where he's going to go quite a lot of the time. That set he makes, he's just ramrod straight, legs are straight, he's only ever going to the middle. Good swing by Lizinets, but not read by the USA. Double touch called. Serbia have levered things up. Podraskin in left standing. USA middle attack has come in so quickly. That'll do perfectly for the USA now. Just getting a little shift on, good serve. Milovic and Petric getting in a muddle. It's another one. I might call by Serbia. Oh, 
Ivana, pogotovo šest, pet. Ok, imao je sreće sada, pazite, nemojte da se previše kruti. Razumete, jer ako sad je, nije udario kratko, ali ste mnogo stegnuti čekajući bombu i ne možete samo da skoračite ka naprijed. Ok, daj dalje sljedeće. Ne, ne, ne. It's three in a row for Anderson. Three huge serves to give the USA a big lead in this third set. Ivovic pretzeled. Touched by Russell. Not quite enough on that one by Anderson, and so Serbia make the block. Bridge. Good touch by Holt. <laughs> Good up by Anderson. Oh, what great angle that is from Petrich. Unforced error from the USA. Serbia have the point. That's a really good recovery by Anderson. But the angle from Petrich, there was only one place he could go, which wasn't quite read by the USA. And then Russell has overcooked that one cross court. That's got to be a carry given against Russell. Low, it wasn't, didn't look like it was a bit sticky. That might be a challenge coming from the USA. It was close to the baseline, that's for sure. Whether or not it caught it, we're going to find out by use of video technology. away in the end. Good blocking that time by Russell, but in fact it's gone down on the side of Russell. So it'll be Serbia's point. Well spotted by the ref, straight down on the side of the USA. Taking a timeout right there. Oh, 
got one left. I thought we could side out on a float. All right. We're going to have to earn it. Okay, we're going to have to earn it. Let's get a pass here. Keep doing what we're doing. We're fine. We're fine. Yeah. Yep. 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 One, two, three. Yep. 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 Draskin, he was nearly off celebrating. He nearly made another block. Russell gets the point. Petric getting oh, absolutely furious with Mesterovic for not making that dig. Maybe he should have been looking at why he hadn't got across and shut down the cross-court angle. Three players went too wide. A serve for Russell. That's a wicked serve. Lubrich doing what he's there supposed to be doing, getting the ball off the block. Now Petric will serve all square in this set. Petric got his body position wrong. Serve. Oh, brilliant by Lubrich. Hope he's okay. He went with a massive leap over the bench and brought it back, but nobody was helped. No one was covering. No one was near him to be able to do anything with it. He's okay, but no one else was doing anything. Tidy side out for Serbia. Podraskin in serve. Dealt with by Russell. Lots of one-handed touches going on, lots of oohs and ahs. No call coming, except to award Serbia the point. Nothing wrong with that, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that either. Good set by Lizanets. A tidy and clever block out by Ivovic off of Smith. A surf from Podraskin in. John Spurrell wants to have a look at it though, in more detail.
and he was right to confirm his suspicions. It was him. Great serve by Podraskin in Serbia now lead. Anderson once again, steady swing onto the baseline. Anderson, no stranger to swinging on the left side. Has done it for the USA. Started as a swing hitter for the USA before going to opposite and actually plays his club volleyball in Zenit Kazan as a swing hitter. Good pick up by Jovovic. Losing that to get called for a double on that one. Most middle blockers are saying that situation, but it might not have sounded great. But it went to where it was supposed to. Double touch called nonetheless. Good up, Shoji. He's made a few of those pickups. And Russell doesn't get it off the block. It's a very good pickup by the Libero. swing from Russell that time. Nothing Petric could do about it. Yes, what a shame. Well, despite the fatigue, despite the fact that the players have played some exhausting volleyball, they're not giving up on anything. And this is a really good chase from Christensen, and he was so close. One to bringing it back and two to nearly hurting himself. Lizinats. Good out by Jovovic. Shoji, ever reliable, making the pick up. And again, but they, nobody was able to help him. He slid in for that one. And Christensen 
turning around, but it was round by his ankles. Serbia take the point, they have set point now. Oh, so close. Lizinets with the serve, set point for Serbia. That was a good serve. Three blockers up against Russell. It's recovered by Shoji. Oh, that's a brilliant swing by Anderson to save set point. And now it's a case whoever gets too clear is going to take this one. That's a brilliant swing right off of Petric. The chance for Serbia goes away. Frustration for Grivic. But now it's anyone's for the taking. It'll be Anderson to serve, and he had a really good run of serves. Three aces last time round. A couple here would be nice. Good ball in by Rosic. Block out from Petric. Serbia, second set point. Very good play from Petric. Lubric. Another chance for the USA. Oh, Petric, he had a swing for the set. The captain had a chance. Oh, he's beside himself. He can't believe he hasn't done it. But it's a brilliant block from Christensen. Another chance now then for Serbia, but it's got to be done from service. You get the feeling whoever takes this set may well go on to take the bronze medal. Such is the way this game has been played. And Tanisiewicz trying to get the fans on side, but they've mostly been shouting for the USA throughout this one. again comes up with the goods just when it's needed It's incredible, it really is, incredible. Going to get a quick decision on this. It is incredible, it's still incredible, it's an ace serve.
And now it's the USA with set point. Holt, deep breath, gets himself focused. Lubrich with a lot of work to do. Oh, and he's done it. Cool, calm and composed. Lubrich gets it off the block and keeps Serbia in the set. Advantage USA again. Christensen. Blue Bridge. Proving to be the go-to man for Serbia at the moment. This is why. Oh, that's nice. It's better than nice, isn't it? It's fantastic. Serbia in trouble. Oh, good up, Shoji. Well, they couldn't uh, have an attack above the net because I think Shoji must have set that. The backcourt set, uh, Libro played it, and then there was an attack as he'd set it from inside the three meter line. Ivovic with the serve. Ivovic not giving up on it, but not able to bring it back into play. Keep going till someone can get two points clear. There was a long look through the net then from Podraskinin as that ball went back on USA's side but didn't land inside the sideline. Free ball, USA. And they take the set, 32-30. The USA lead 2-1 in this bronze medal match.
USA seven serving aces. That's unbelievable. And in so much as that they only won 32 30. Serbia, well, kept in it by the errors the USA made. Lubridge keeps his place on court for Serbia. So too does Petric. No changes for the USA. Nice start. Pipe attack established. Sanders still got a few issues with his hitting arm. Keeps shaking it, moving it around. He's not overly comfortable with it. But he's on court, he's playing. USA a 2 1 up. That should be a double. The play continues. It's so important, cannot, cannot stress enough. Things happen in a rally, but you as a player think the referee should have called. But you don't get involved, you just play to the whistle. Oh, listen, that's felt that. And that'll be a carry against Christensen. And Lizzie Nats will be delighted because he's made a dig that's given Serbia the point. That was the only gap in the block, and Smith found it brilliantly. Combination of peripheral vision and skill. Another big hit this time, it's Serbia coming up with it. Never really going to get to it. 110 kilometers an hour. It's a big hit for Ivovic. Very reliable, Matt Anderson. A serve for Anderson. Brilliant. Of 
up some of the line. But they have challenged it, Serbia. It's an ace serve. Draskin in. No carry for that one, nothing wrong with that. Holtz above the ball. Russell. Very nice swing hitting. Ibovic took it off of... Uh, Rosic got back out wide, available to come in and have the swing. Lovely. It's starting to work now for... The USA, the pipe attack, they're having more and more success with it. That's a top swing from uh, Luberic. An understated player, Lubrich. Doesn't get emotional, doesn't he? It's just does his job very, very well. That time, Lizinac was waiting for that pipe, not buying the quick attack. Instead, saving up for the pipe. Christensen, lovely, second ball attack, and USA lead at the technical timeout.
Serbia able to get their middle running once the ball's good and into Jovovic, as it was here. Maybe with Smith committing on that one, it wasn't quite high enough. USA in rotation one, they've got three front court attackers, but Sander and Anderson hitting from unusual positions for them, well, particularly Sander, not so much Anderson. It doesn't matter though, Sander, cool as you like, roll shot, point USA, off the rotation very quickly, and he goes back to serve now. Rotation one is where the setter is at at the start of the service. And whilst we were looking at that, Sanders served the ball out. Play from Russell. Say in numbers on the block, but Lubritz has got some space. And despite Smith getting a good touch, he's unable to direct it to any one of his teammates. Serbia lead by one. Fantastic hit from Anderson. He comes in on the cross court angle, but able to whip the ball to the line. Actually, he's hit that really well. He's hit through that one. Actually, had top spin, not a side spin. Superb. Serbia scrambling. Two front court options for Christensen, and it's Russell he goes to, but he's dealt with by Mastirovic. And then Petric is dealt with by USA's block. Serbia not paying attention to the fact that Christensen's front row. Podraskinin was thinking about the middle attack that was coming and wasn't at all ready for that. His hands down as well, no chance. Look at that, it's free, completely free for Christensen. Timeout Serbia. Jedino 
koji ima serije servisa je Anderson. Servira po 4-5 puta i uzira nam serije pojena. Ajde da probamo ljudi da kad ga primimo dobro, da dignemo precizno i da prođemo, da probamo da ga skidamo odmah sa servisa. Anderson, kada je visoka lopta, ulozi na četvrti metar. Znači, gađete po prstima, po paraleli, da istarate blok. Ajde, 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 ajde. And again, causing trouble. Lovely set as well towards the spot Anderson was moving into. Shoji onto it. Holt down in front of the block. Just what the USA wanted. Oh, it's given us in by the referee at the line judge. The referee's given it out. We're going to have a look at this one by Hawkeye. All right, but out it is. Petrich. Uh, some good improvisation by Russell. Into the second technical timeout, USA with a big lead, and they lead by two sets to one. Russell. Free ball here for the US. And Russell gets it off the block. John Sparora told the team to watch out for Ibovic. And it's a free ball that Ibovic gave them. That Russell deals with. USA now with a five point lead in this fourth set.
Mihailovic makes an error. They're looking for a net touch now. So I think there'll be a challenge coming from Serbia. Eighteen twelve would be a huge lead for the USA. Thirteen seventeen makes it a little bit more realistic for Serbia. The net was already going up and down because of the play previously, where the ball had hit the net as it went over, and that's a classic where players think that there was a net touch because it's moving, and the goldfish syndrome of not remembering the ball had hit the net fifteen seconds earlier. play Podraskinin. Christensen got up there, he was right in the zone, but Podraskinin with a very good cut over his own shoulder, his left shoulder. Holt just drifted, wasn't able to get a really good contact on the ball and force it down on Serbia's side. Quick ball, Holt off the block, Lubrich nowhere near it, despite his best efforts. It's an ace surf for Holt. The USA are really taking it to Serbia now. Kovatrevic is to play the whole way and he less left it go. Let it go. Ajde da probamo holtu, da ostavimo da nam napravi jas uz liniju. Molim vas. Nemojte da nam napravi jas u konfliktnoj zoni između 6 i 5 i 6 i 1. Znači pomerite se ranije. U redu, skupite ka sredini, naterajte ga sa sad da vas vidi da mora da udari u liniju. Ok, ajmo dalje. Ajde, ajmo dalje. Ovo. Good ball in, and Ivovic gets the block out. Christensen got smacked into by Smith. Anderson able to generate so much power into the ball. So hard, he's got it right through Ivovic's hands. Everybody's getting in on the jump serve and getting in on the aces. And now it's Christensen for the USA. 
That's brilliant as well. It's right over Lizinac, in between Ivovic and Rosic. Horrible place for Serbia to deal with that ball. Christensen again. Same spot again, making it difficult for Rosic. But Lubric comes to the rescue. This time Smith bangs into Anderson. Oh, that's a good serve. Anderson pinched that one off, Russell. It's another serve that brings up another ace. This time it's Serbia who have it. Hey, this is it, okay? What we've done a great job passing this guy for clutch side outs. Here's another one. Yeah, he's got Pass this thing up. Uh, Take good cut. Here we go. One, two, three. Hey, USA. Hey. love the way Spiro gets the message across. Not negative, just again about how well we've done to get side acts from it, to get these clutch side acts. We've done that really, really well. Let's go back, let's get another one. Simple, effective. Gets the message across. Good ball up from Shoji. Ivanovic makes a very good dig. Kostic brings it back into play, but it's free ball here for the USA with three front court attackers. And Anderson gets the better of Luberic. And they get off of that rotation. And they're now two points away from winning this match. Really nice play. Cuffing that one to the line. Serbia are in trouble a bit here. Well, they were until Lizinac went over the top of the block. Tough serve to deal with here for the USA. And they've dealt with it because Anderson gets block out. It's now match point for the USA. Smith with the serve. Lubridge to keep Serbia in it, and he has done for the time being. Lubridge. Pressure's really on Serbia here. It's all over. USA have beaten Serbia by three sets to one. And they've taken the bronze medal here at the World Championship in Italy. Huge relief for the USA. Going some way to making up for well, their disappointment of not making it through to the gold medal match. But they finish on a high, they'll be on the podium. Commiserations to Serbia, who despite their very best efforts and some amazing results here at this World Championship, leave with no medal, finishing fourth.
There was just one game too far for Serbia in the end.